Okay, so the Mazda Bravo engine has um, fucked piston rings, I think. It's getting really excessive blowed by. You can see in one of my shorts under this cap and it just flies off. So it's rebuild time. I've already ordered a rebuild kit. Um, I got down here a bare cylinder head. So, um, yeah, you're gonna rebuild that. Let's get a new cylinder head, all new gaskets, all new seals, all new bearings. Should be laughing. So, I'm gonna start pulling down. This is the engine that was in the Bravo originally. So, it has about 380,000 Ks on it. Apparently, it has either a cracked head or a fucked head gasket. So, we'll see that as we go. All I'm gonna do first off is pull off all the extremities. So, turbo, manifold, intake, injectors, alternator. That's probably well it for now. Pull them off and then um, start removing the head so that I can have a look at the pistons and the bores and our head gasket and all that. See the state of it all. So the rebuild has begun. This will be part one, mostly a disassembly video. And then the next couple of videos are gonna be all based on pulling this bad boy apart, putting it back together. So you're going to paint the block, all sorts, is going to get a whole new life. I'm going all standard everything, I'm not putting in any forged parts or anything too fancy. I'm actually turning down the boost on the Korea, um, the Bravo altogether. I just want it to be a real reliable beach rig. So yeah, stay tuned on the rebuild. I'll uh, film everything. Everything's smacked down with some penetrating oil. So these bolts are biggest, the biggest concerns. It's just getting them so that they are uh, so that they don't snap like as you can see the last dude snapped one in there no big deal the whole the whole head cylinder head's been replaced so I need new studs in there anyway no be at all I'll leave the downpipe on the turbo rip the turbo off rip the manifold off I've already said this by alternator, plenum, injectors, injector lines, rip this off, start moving into start moving into the head removal. So I need to get off all the big stuff first and that'll also help a ton getting the weight down so that I can move it around easier, get into the bottom, see what all the bearings are like, all the thrust bearings and all that. Laughing. Yeah, it could be a couple of things, so we'll have a look once we get that head off. Yeah. Please tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah. Please tell me all the bad, never good, fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah. Please say any negative thoughts, I pop off when I hear people say I cannot. I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong, I won't stop to the top, so you better back off and get lost. I'ma stay loud, stay proud, never running now, never heading south, I'll be spreading now, call it word of mouth. Alrighty, hot side off. So now, injectors, intake plenum, and we're off to the races. A slow burn like a disease Just tell me that I can and I'll show you things that you couldn't believe Just tell me that I can Wanna hear it out your mouth, yeah Give me fuel, it's a tool that I use To go ahead and run my f mouth, yeah I take shots, I take loss I make shots, I miss lots I tell you get big box You get yachts, you swing lots And pop off a big shot I ain't done chasing Got big dreams, bigger things, impatient Who's at the top think they need replacement? Who's at the top think I'm gonna erase it? Face it I don't give up quick, I don't give up I won't give up this Cause I know that I want it Know that I'm on it, I'll make it, I promise 
Get demonetized, okay. Intake off, hot side off. Now, time to timing cover off, timing belt off, um, tap it cover off. Looks like return line, take that off, and then we'll be looking at getting this head off. Party time, it's probably about I'm probably an hour in so far. So doing pretty good I reckon. That's pretty fucking loose. Belt doesn't look in bad shape, but uh that's loose as timing belt off, timing cover off fully. There it is, tension off spring. Well that's off. It's set to it's timing marks. So I'm assuming that means cylinder one, stop dead center. We'll tell when we get this off. Let's have a look ski. Time to time to start diving into the into the tapper cover, into the cylinder head. Fun. Alrighty. <laughs> Look at that, you can see see the water. So this girl had some pretty serious some pretty serious shit going on. And she well not serious, it's just a head gasket or crack in the head. My guess is yeah, my guess is there's gonna be a crack in the head. So All right, so here we are. Head gasket was pretty rooted, but it wasn't terrible. Um, we're really happy about this, nice and flat. The balls are nice. Um, so cylinder three was where the major issue is. It's a big crack right here, between up to the exhaust valve. So between the intake valve, one of the intake valves and the exhaust valve, there's also another one starting, sorry, just up here. All the other valves seem like they're uh, no cracks, but uh, yeah, huge crack right here. Pretty common on these. Everything else is looking pretty good though. So that's all for this video. This is part one of the disassembly. Next time we're gonna flip her over, start pulling out pistons and main bearings and stuff. 